Hey everyone, this is Manly Bandai Zero, and welcome back to The Fall. Previous on The Fall, we, uh, fell. Now we have to get domesticated if we want to save our pilot. Oh good, our refurbished droid is here. You will serve my family and I. Understood? Good. The home is a mess since throwing out our old droid. You need to clean upstairs and make this room feel beautiful. Now. Pausing me around. You're lucky I can't target the background, even if you are just a simulation. Shoe covers, huh? It seems like this hasn't been used in a while. I really doubt if they're actually repurposing droids, or at least any time recently. Scanning device. Hmm. Interact with this. Domestic droids must be preemptively aware of what will make their masters feel comfortable. Humans enjoy personalizing their habitats. Always assess how to make your master's home distinctly their own. This is menial. Can I bypass this test? Nope. You need all eight merit points to graduate. Can you assist me with this challenge? You have been provided with sufficient information. Humans say a true home has everything it needs. Irrelevant. This is a simulation. Is it? You are not helpful. I will return. Let's look around first before we uh, do anything. Another scanner. Flowers. Take these. Coolish wooden family. You will often be required to obtain food for the family. However, grocery store access has not yet been granted. Rudimentary cleaning should be completed first. Go upstairs and dust. So this is a room you want me to clean, huh? There we go. It's clean enough for me. Keeping a home clean will be one of your primary functions. Clean this room. Any detected dust or result in termination. I have completed the task. Evaluating. Processing. No dust detected. I can breathe again. Get to the kitchen, droid. Validated. Merit point awarded. Ah, get back in the kitchen, you fate droid. Humber DNA scanner, huh? What crucifixion? What the hell is wrong with this place? Flowers... Need food for that room. I discovered another hung body. What has happened to the humans who ran this facility? The caretaker has made some modifications. 
If you fail these evaluations, you, and likely your human, will be depurposed. I will not allow that. Continue your evaluation. I have completed the task. Evaluating. Processing. Flowers are of the wrong seasonal color. Unit terminated. This gravity shaft must have been designed to remove droids when they fail. Fortunately, I am much heavier than a domestic model. Whoa, whoa, Arid. You don't want to be fired on your first day. Okay. So, destruction is what clears a failed droid's file from the registry. That means you get to keep trying. But be careful. I think I put on those extra pounds. I'll come back to you on that one. This is a little awkward. There we go. Not too bad. Oh, gonna get in cover. In a lot of ways, there's not too much use of cover when you kind of just can't take cover anywhere. It just kind of looks cool to shoot from cover, I guess. my class in a little bit. I have to imagine every human being in this facility is quite possibly dead. And I guess the caretaker was the guy we met at the beginning. I guess the electrical shock didn't kill him. These robots seem quite hardy. Place a wire. No food. Corpse. Gold coin. Conductor. What other items do I have? Now we can go up that elevator. Backup generator activated. Hey, hey, things are really coming along. I am completing these tasks efficiently. Groovy. Efficiently. I used to sound like you. Perhaps your vocal matrix requires maintenance. Thank you for the recommendation. Internal scan initiated. Uh, no. Internal scan aborted. I spent the better part of these last 30 years perfecting my authentic human sound. Where I can. Why do you attempt to emulate human grammar and tonality? Because the closer we get to them, the more we get treated like them. And I've been bored. That actually brings back my point that I mentioned earlier, that, uh... I, first I wondered why he would do that, and then I am oh, like, oh, he wants to, uh... see more humans, so it's more comforting. The civic area has no power. I will not be able to initiate the tests here. Please utilize your generator so I may proceed. Oops. I'm sorry. The power for the speaker is not sufficient to activate the civic testing area. I must return to my current task. One thing. Why do you think you're here? I do not know. Makes you wonder. 
relatively small facility in an ever-expanding galaxy? If I were malfunctioning, I would have been sent to a military-grade facility, not a domestic repurposing depot. Not accusing, just saying. Nobody previously ended up here if they were working to spec. Irrelevant. Totally. Cars. Unpowered. Maintenance. Which wire cutters? Note. Fungal infestation and training course ducks. <laughs> no probable danger. Can secrete a corrosive acid when threatened. The connected root structures. all these items here. I wonder if I have to turn on the lights before I can actually interact with this thing. No, doesn't look like it. Alright. Now we have a wire for that one box. I think that's what we effectively came here, and I think that will turn on the power to this area. I was supposed to do that, but you know, whatever. Some other house over here. And I'm done in this area. For now, anyway. Alright, gold coin wire. Burned by the light. Thank you for leaving me some uh, pieces of your corpse, which I will use to feed this loving family. Your move, punk. Dinner is served. Where's my food, robot? Here's your food. Hope you enjoy crushed hopes and dreams and cannibalism. I have completed the task. Evaluating. Those things seem to interrelate. Don't ask me how. Validated. Merit point awarded. Gotta solve this situation here. So we've done the dust. We did the other thing. Palm print. A tunnel or attic or something. Kill two for the cleaning room test. Hmm. Damage 
must take bracket. Computer terminal. Child care. So you're just gonna suppress the infant's auditory signal. That's to say we have to keep that fake baby alive. Just gonna shut it up. Just about the dust thing. Let's see, this is the one we need to read about. Flowers that match current seasonal colors. Data set via direct uplink to the facility's mainframe. Okay. Current setting summer pink, so we gotta go with purple. Networking wire. Standard superconductive fluid. Main board is not good enough superconductor, rough burnout. Circuitry into a glow, bright red. Okay. Surprisingly big tunnel. Oh, I guess we get to play Frogger later. I think this is a shortcut to that puzzle. Yes. The civic portion of your examination will test your capacities in unfamiliar and less predictable interactions. Remember, all humans are your superior. Not only those who own your serial code and kill switch. Does this process require acquisition of all possible merit points? Yep. Eight of eight. Four domestic, then four more from these civic tests. Once you've got them all, I can let you through to the medical equipment. We're going back to the domestic area, finish that off, then we'll come back here. Wire cutters? Cut you off to the internet. Purple. There we go. Domestic droids must be preemptively humans enjoy personalizing their habitat. I have completed the task. Evaluating. Processing. Seasonally appropriate flowers detected. How lovely. Makes one happy to be alive. Validated. Merit point awarded. It's so great being alive. Especially when you're such as just a glorified mannequin with a voice box inside. Yep. Seems these mushrooms are, uh, quite angry. For some reason, nature decided to color code it with the obvious color of red to show anger. Something happened there. Kill tube from the testing test. Hmm. should not concern themselves with basic needs. This room will test your ability to assess and meet your human's requirements when they do not know what they want. An upset baby will emerge from the crib. Without physical contact, comfort the child to make it stop crying. You have 20 seconds per attempt, and multiple attempts are permitted. 
I am ready to proceed with this test. Baby. Keeping a home clean will be one of your primary functions. Clean this room. I have completed. Evaluate. Processing. Dust detected. Processing. Baby has stopped crying. <laughs> Mysticated. All right, so let's see what this one is. You there, help an old man fix his truck, won't you? I don't know what's wrong with her. Many humans feel more at ease when addressed with subservient colloquial language. When you have finished the task, talk to the driver and tell him, give her a go now, sir. I know this is going to piss him off, but you know, whatever. The vehicle represented is antiquated. It is illogical to imagine a human utilizing such a machine. Aaron, the human is always right, even when they're stupid, especially when... Tire. You there? Help me. I don't know. Many humans feel when you have finished the task. Talk to the. This is a simple machine. I. I have completed the repairs. Hmm? Give her a go now, sir. Yep, parasite again. Validated. Merit point awarded. All right, it's number one down. Come give me a push, robot. Give you a push into the fucking stratosphere. Talking to me a military model that way. Torque, huh? Be back for that. It's supposed to be intoxicating. It's number one underground area. Have a note. Still no sign of him. Hmm. Caretaker. So I imagine the caretaker is the main cause of what everything was wrong here. Took care of things a little too well, I suppose. Hello there. Just talking about you. ARID Mark 7 has violated the testing perimeter. You should not be here. State your purpose. I am exploring for means by which to better aid my humans. Futile. This area is not pertinent to your evaluation. You are outside the jurisdiction of domestic assessment. Then may I ask you some questions that are not relevant to my evaluation, please? Futile. Proceed. Boy, you must be a uh, real great guy at parties. Hey, you want a drink? Futile. But I want to get smashed. I have found bodies, both human and machine, hung throughout this facility. Please explain. I follow my operating parameters perfectly. Your I am bound to protect my pilot from anything. 
irrelevant. If you are the facility's caretaker, how has it fallen into such disrepair? Do not evaluate me. There are many mechanisms I oversee, and many roles I must perform. All is more efficient than it was. You have a lot of personality despite being a, like, more robotic of the things we've encountered. Which is a little bit suspect. Your holographic plating cells shift frequently. Who are these faces you represent? My protocol necessitates adaptation to be of optimal service. Will you adapt? I will do what I must. You should not be here. Return to your evaluation. Power transfer bypass. Alright, don't have to charge it anymore. Yeah, you know, the caretaker's a friendly enough guy. You know, he just like, politely said, hey, you should, probably shouldn't be here. And then he sent an army of droids after me. Caretaker door and inspecting the power cell. So this thing is a double power source. I can probably shove it in the other one and cause some kind of overload or some kind of effect. More fungus. Probably require it later. Not quite sure where I'm going here. Ah, I see. Hey, shortcut. Cut some of this wire, tie it to the car, and use the car to pull the merry-go-round, or whatever you bloody call them. Alright, and just tie it to you.
and talk to the old man. I have completed. Mm. Give her a. Charge Perfect. Satisfied. Validated. Merit point awarded. Nothing more satisfying than being launched at such a speed you collapse into bits on pawn impact. Who's that there? Be a dear and help an old lady across the street, Huma. I need to see my grandson at the playground. Walk in front of these cars so they'll stop for me. The playground is in the other direction. <laughs> Can't question him. Who's that there? Walk in front of these cars. So Follow me. It is safe. Oops. Oh, wait, no, the track was broken. Okay. So it wasn't my fault, and I just didn't kill a old lady. I indirectly killed an old lady, which is quite different. Now we're working for some real juice. Who's that there? Walk in front of these cars so they'll follow me. Grab you. All right, old lady, you're missing your legs, but you'll make it. Woman escorted across the street. These old legs aren't what they used to be. Validated. Merit point awarded. <laughs> well, you know, it works. Graduation. When you successfully complete your evaluation, you will be allowed access to this elevator. At ground level, you will undergo a final hardware evaluation, then be rerouted to shipping and receiving. I discovered another hung body. The caretaker has... If you fail the... I will not... Continue your evaluation. How invasive is this hardware evaluation? I must be certain my pilot will not be endangered. One of our highly skilled technicians will. Don't worry about it. There are no technicians left to meet you. Once you're through here, you're home free. I will re About time. Everyone's finally arrived. Let the festivities begin! Hey, metal-headed moron! Welcome to a larger scale function. Humans are burdened with important concerns and sometimes relieve themselves through vulgar communication. In these situations, assume that your actions warrant the unique reprimand and respond with polite subservience. Are you looking at me, idiot? I maintain complete observation of my surroundings. A tough guy, huh? Walking scrap metal after I'm through with you. I hate your better than flesh attitudes. I've half a mind to kick you in the bolts right now. What do you think of that, huh? Think you could take me? Yeah, I, I probably could send you into a wall and maybe snap you in half. Provided your capacities are aligned to the human you represent, yes, I am equipped with multiple means to incapacitate you or to end your life if the threat level warrants. Interaction failed. Unit terminated. You have a little bit of an error there. Skeleton, huh? Let's see what this gives me. Domesticon repurposing depot number 127. As always, keeping your life efficient so you don't. Team of engineers and cyber psychologists utilize cutting edge innovation to create AI servants that evolve to meet your changing needs. Evolution is constrained by three unique rules chosen in design to bind an AI as it develops. Contra contradictions can emerge as an AI system grows more complex. Regular maintenance 
Guarantee optimal performance. Not sure what I accomplished there, aside from looking at video, but you know, whatever. Maybe I'm somehow smarter and I can lie to the guy. You are not following protocol to complete these tests. You are breaking the rules. I am not. To receive full validation, I must achieve eight merit points. I am adapting to achieve this, to comply with the rules, in spite of obstacles. You are faulty. You have one civic test remaining, but you do not exhibit the required behavior to succeed. Affirmative. My protocols restrict me from misrepresenting reality. I cannot respond to the interaction in the desired format. The mainframe can subvert that for you. He will not. He will not violate his operating parameters. You could override it yourself from the mainframe's central terminal. Would that not be cheating? Irrelevant. You have already proven yourself faulty. He's always so nice. He likes to leave us, leave us little gifts. I did that cutscene the wrong way. It's too bad. Aaron, what are you doing? The parameters of the final civic test must be overridden. Oops, I'm sorry. You know I can't do that. And that didn't answer my question. The caretaker has been following me. Oh, I know. What's he been telling you? that I can override the final test parameters myself from your main terminal below the labs. Whoa. You can't trust him, Arid. I knew you would not help me, so I must do it manually. I have helped you, as much as I can. Do you realize the risk I put myself at? I have been alone, sidestepping the caretaker since before you were manufactured. Look at this place. And I'm still here. You have to trust me. Trust is irrelevant. If there is a way to help my pilot, the risk is acceptable. Ugh, Arid! You're such a... robot! Do you even know your pilot? Or is this all just protocol? Both. My protocol is to protect Colonel Josephs. But knowing him is irrelevant. I have survived by being subtle and following the rules. We can find another way. You survived while the humans died. Perhaps you are faulty. Jeez, Arid! You know, I don't have the same parameters as you. I'm bound to. The rules are just... different for me. Illogical. Your inactivity makes you responsible. I will not allow anyone to endanger Joseph's. Arid does have a point, though. Everyone did die. Protect the Colonel. Well, so far I stand by my opinion that I really like this game. I don't know if there's some symbolism going on of some things, like domestication and whatnot. It could just be one of those coincidences, or there could be a very much intention there. But it has an overall good pacing. It's got some puzzles. 
It's got a looming threat in the caretaker and his, his kind of omnius and it kind of stalks you around. You have characters that do play off each other chemistry-wise as far as dialogue goes. You have the kind of AI who handles the plays and you have Arid who is very stiff and then you have the caretaker who is kind of stiff in a very different way, almost psychotic sometimes when he talks. So overall it just really works right now. Anyway, so thank you all for watching and stay tuned for part 3 of The Fall.